Hey everyone, it's Kelly here. I wanted to do a video of my coloring book haul for the month of June. I got a few of them. I went a little overboard. It was my birthday month, so I'm like, what the heck? I'll treat myself to some uh, coloring books. So, I'm sure you've seen a lot of these, because that's where I've seen them. I've seen them on YouTube, of course. All those enablers out there. So I'm hoping that I will enable a few of you to get some of these books. So, I guess let's get started. Now there's a lot of them from Color Questopia. <laughs> That's like my go-to. I love their books. I love the fact that they have like the black backgrounds. And then you can get the white ones if you like. But I prefer the back black... The tongue twister. The black backgrounds. So, let's get started. Now, I'm not going to flip through all of these. I'm sure you've seen them all. Maybe I'll just show a couple pages for those of you that might not have. But, alright. So, the first one I'm going to show you is uh, the candy coloring book. Can you see that? Let's, let's do that. Alright. Okay. The candy coloring book. Uh, of course, the, the black background. And it's by Color Questopia. Here's the color key. I'm sure everybody's familiar with that. And, uh, let me take that tabby off. But yeah, I thought it was really cute. I seen it, I seen it on someone's channel. But yeah, just a bunch of sweets and, you know, who doesn't like sweets? Like, I do. So I thought it'd be fun to color some. So yeah. So there's that one. And then the next one, let me take this tabby off because I wanted to make sure that I kept them separated because I have just been a buy-in. And then the next one is the Beautiful Ocean Black Background by Color Questopia. Yeah, I thought this one was really cute. So yeah, it's just, just sea life. Dolphins, you know, I'm sure there's some turtles in here and some fish. I just thought it'd be fun. Wow. I like how they have samples of stuff, you know. But yeah. But yeah, so that's that. I'm hoping they have at least one turtle in here. Come on, people. Well, I guess not. I love turtles. Ah, there they are. I love turtles. I love turtles. I collect turtles. Not real turtles. I did have a real turtle at one time, but like, I could, like the beanie baby turtles. And then I have like little like turtle knickknacks you know but yeah and then the next book that i'd like to show you is this one beach coloring book by color questopia with the black background of course i thought i thought this one was really cute too you know just a, some beach scenes and well that's not it that's not it either. Well, dang. Are we to the... Oh, there we go. Oh, that's cute. Ladies with their sundresses and their sun hats. That's cute. I like that. But, yeah. So, yeah, I thought this one was really cute. Oh, by the way, I got all of these books off Amazon. Amazon always takes my money. Always. I can't not get stuff off Amazon. I'll be watching your YouTube videos and and I'm like, oh, I gotta have that. So then I go and put it in my cart and before you know it, I got packages being delivered. The next one is Incredible Cats and Kittens. I love kitties. I have three of them. I love my kitties. We had four, but my boyfriend's cat passed away uh, during Rona 2020. This was a sad day. But yeah. So it's just a, just a bunch of cats. Hopefully they're not like all purple and stuff because that's weird. The Santa Lisa Frank book. Although, I would color that if she had one. I remember Lisa Frank stuff from back in the day and all back in like the 80s. And now it's all coming back. Yeah, 80s were great. Next book, 
is Gnomes. It's a black background by Color Questopia. And uh, I like Gnomes. We have a few of them out in front of our house. So I thought it'd be fun to color. I mean, it, it's okay. It's not like, it's not my favorite, but some of the pictures in here would probably be cute. But, oh, we're back in the samples again. But yeah, so there's that one. And then this one I got for my birthday from my boyfriend. He got it he got it off my wish list. This one is the one he got me. The relaxing color inverted mandala. Um I don't know who it's by. Some life drawing. Alright. So yeah, it's just the black and then you color the white lines. I figured I would use gel pens or something. Make it sparkly or something. But yeah. I haven't colored in it yet. I haven't colored in any of these books that I'm showing you. They have been sitting in my drawer. Because I wanted to do a video. Of them. But yeah. Before I colored in them. This, this book is like so smooth. Like it's. I don't know. It's got some kind of coating on it. Then my next book is this one. Living Landscapes. Cross Stitch Style Adult Coloring Book. Um, I forgot who I saw this, whose channel I saw this on, but I thought, well, I cross-stitched and I like to color, so this might be fun. So I love this paper. I wish all coloring books had this paper. But yeah. Somebody was calling me, like, leave me alone. I'm doing a video. <laughs> but yeah, all these little landscapes I thought would be fun. But yeah. I'm still trying to figure out how how you do this book. Like, I'm really going to need my glasses. <laughs> so I could see all them symbols and stuff. I'm probably going to mess this up. I better start. I better start small. Like, I need one small <laughs> But yeah, I thought it'd be fun. Something different. And then my next book I want to show you is this one. Stained Glass Tiffany Windows. Color by Number by Such and Such Diva. Deva. I don't know how to pronounce. Everybody pronounces it, it differently. So I'll just be like Sachin. Everybody knows who that is. But yeah. I saw this on many, many channels. Um, it's really pretty. I have not colored in it, but I think I might have to do that today because I really like these. These, these little pictures and stuff, they are really pretty. Like, all of them are really pretty. Like, this book is, oh, I love that. It's just nice. This is really nice. All the little stain, it's just beautiful. Oh, and then you get, like, color sheets. You know, test your colors in there, in the back. Here's a, oh, excuse me. You can go and look at all his books on his, on his uh, website. But yeah, I thought this was a great book. I'm probably going to color in that today. And then my next one is Interior Design by Color Questopia. This should, I should have just called this a Color Questopia haul because like, the majority of these books are Color Questopia. But that's alright. You know, they got a lot of books out there. I'm sure you've seen this one. I got the back, uh, black background. I want to say back background. That doesn't even sound right. But it's what my, my tongue wants to form. <laughs> but yeah. Now I know I've seen people coloring these and the little like colors that they picked... Some of them are kind of strange, but, you know, it is, was it, it is what it is, I guess. So, I thought it would be fun. Then my next book by Color Questopia is Cactus and Succulents Coloring Book. I have a succulent. I thought they were so cute, so I bought one. I'm having trouble keeping it alive. I don't know what it is about these black thumbs that I have, but I cannot keep plants alive. To save my life. 
How do you kill a succulent? You barely have to water it. I don't know. Any tips? Leave them down below because I could it could use all the help it could get. Anyway, back to my back to my uh, coloring books. But yeah, I killed my philodendron. I forgot what else I killed. But yeah, I thought this book would be really cute too. I like succulents. They're so cute. I don't want mine to die. Yeah, so there's that one. Then my next one by Color Questopia is Lighthouses. The black background. You know me in the black background. I do not like the white lines. I do not want to color them. I do not want to color them. Yeah, I saw this on someone else's channel. All these books I've seen on someone's channel, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, I'm sure you all have seen this one. But anyway, my next one is this. Country Farm Scene, Black Background by Color Questopia. All right, little farm, little chicken. So cute. More chickens. What the heck? Why'd they make a picture of some logs? Or are that hay bales? That might be hay bales. Yeah, that's probably hay bales, but that's, I don't know. That's a little weird, but whatever. Oh, that's cute. Guess they figured we wanted to color some hay bales. We could have put something else in the picture. I don't know about you, but I don't really like, I don't really mind hay bales, but it's not like I want to color them. Anyway. All right. So I got this one. Now I was not happy because I could not find a black background, but I love sloths. They are my spirit animal. Yes. I love them. I would love to hold one. That's like on my bucket list. They are so cute. But they didn't have the black background. I'm very sad. I had to get it though because I needed it. So maybe one day they will get the black background. Until then, I will find something to fill these little lines in with. I don't know what to use. I've seen several people use different things. Tombow markers, Sergeant Sparkly Pen, Gel Pens. I've seen all kinds of things. I'm going to have to figure it out. I don't know. I don't know, but I thought this was so cute. This is also off Amazon. A lot of cute little pictures, Mama and Baby. Oh, I just love sloths. They're the cutest. Oh, that's samples again. I mean, that's nice that they do that. Corgi happiness. Well, there's a book that might be out or coming out. So then you get Corgi pictures. Let's see what else they got. Oh, Fairy Magic. I got that one, I think. Dragon Fantasy, if any of you guys want to look for that one. Here's a sample page. All right, that's pretty cool. Amazing Owls. I might have that one. I don't remember. There's that one. And then New York Mosaic. So these are some of the books, I guess, that are coming out. There you go. And then I got a book that I love. I love these Color by Colors books by Kira Shershneva. Is it Shershneva? Yes. I love these books. I don't think I've colored in this one. But I want to. I love these. Oh, yes. I love these books. They're so cute. Look at them. I just love them. Yeah, this is Country Life. I think I have all of her color by color books now. I really think so. I have been trying to find them, and then she came out with that. What was the last one she came out with? That other Mandala one? The, like, the, the half size one? Yeah, I got that too somewhere. And then I saw these. But this one, I didn't know, came with this, like, iridescent 
like gel stuff that you're supposed to color with too and it came like all bent up i was not happy with amazon that day i don't like my books to be all bent up but i'm sure you've seen these on uh some channels but they're like this but then you got the uh the what you call it marker pen so whenever you see like stuff with the star i don't know if you can see that stuff with those little stars that's the spot that you have to put that stuff on after you color it i guess so so first you color it and then you go back over it with the little this little special pen i thought it was cute this is all glittery so i guess it's supposed to look like that when you're done i don't know if you can see the shimmery shim shimmery yeah, so there's that one. And then I got this right here. Another one. Oh, yeah, these are by Mindware. This includes a special spaces for adding glittery accents. So I'm guessing you could just add your own glittery accent, too. Like, you can even coordinate, like, if the star is, like, a yellow spot, you can always go over. If you have the stickles, like, yellow, you can go over that instead of just using that iridescent, whatever they have that comes with it. Now, I didn't do that. I don't know who did that. But I didn't do that. Hmm. That is so weird. There's just a random mark on my... Hmm. And I don't have little bitties that come here, so... That is so weird. Maybe someone got this book and didn't want it. I don't know. But anyway, there's that one under the sea. Oh, did I show you that this one was sweet, sweet treats? I got sidetracked. Did I even show you? Oh, look at that. That's that's nice. I like that one a lot. That's so cute. I love gumball machines. I had one when I was a kid. We uh, It was like a bank. And then my last book, but certainly not least, is by Creative Haven. Sea Life, color by number. Uh, or does George Tufexis? I hear his name a lot when y'all are showing me your book. His uh, with your uh, hello, words are hard today. When you're all when you're showing me all your books and stuff, he must be popular with Creative Haven. Look at these pictures. I love these pictures. I never know what to use to color in these. I tried colored pencils, but my hand would hurt because I had to press so hard. And I don't know if I want to use markers. I don't even know if I have any markers that will get into there. These little small spaces. I don't know. If you guys have any tips on uh, coloring these these types of color by number, the, the Creative Haven. Because I have several of them. I have by the, by the, by the sea, I guess it's called. And then I have this one. Yeah, I think I have a few more somewhere. I have a lot of coloring books. I even have some put away. But, uh, yeah. So that, that, uh, ends my coloring book haul for the month of June. And it was, it was quite a bit. And it, this video wasn't too long. So hopefully you guys will watch it and stay until the end with, uh, you know, my train wreck here. Words are hard. Yeah, I'm trying to say black background. That's, <laughs> sometimes my tongue gets twisted. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed my coloring books. Um, I don't know what uh, what video I want to do next. But also, if you have any, um, uh, I'm looking to find um, a nice or a, a like a color, like a coloring journal, not really a journal, but like a planner to like do like plan, you know, monthly things like tasks and everything. If you guys know of a good one, you could recommend, you know, to me, please leave that down in the comments and, uh, I would appreciate it. And then if you, uh, know of any coloring books that I might like, you could also drop that down there too. And if you liked my video, please subscribe and like. Uh, that way uh, you can uh, watch the other videos that I post. And if you want to hit that bell to get notified when I do post a video, you can go ahead and do that too. 
So I guess that's it, and I will see you all in my next video. Hopefully you guys get some crafting done and uh, are all doing well. So I will uh, talk with you guys later. All right, bye.